What it do, man? It's your boy Battle Truth coming to you live and direct from the Battle Truth headquarters. We in the white room. Let's get right off into this, man. Battle rap is officially under federal investigation. Remember, I told y'all that. Remember, I told y'all that. I told y'all that what? Last year? <laughs> Last year? I told y'all that two years ago. Battle Rap is officially under federal investigation. Yep. It's no secret no more. Come to find out the feds is subscribed to Battle Rap Spaces. Y'all Battle Rappers Instagram and Twitter pages. Literally. This ain't speculation no more. This is not speculation no more. This ain't like, oh, you know, the government, they watching everything, they listen to everything. Let me say they are literally personal persons, individuals like you and I, every day in battle rap, literally watching as a fan, but also working for the feds, drug, uh, uh, <coughs> man, how did I forget the dang old name for this? Hold on. I'm tripping, man. I'm tripping, man. DEA. Come on, let's get this stuff cracking. They tripping. How how I forget that so quick like that? Drug Enforcement Agency. Right. Yeah. <clears throat> the DEA, Drug Enforcement Agency. The DEA is officially, man, subscribed to y'all spaces, y'all Instagrams, y'all Twitters, y'all YouTubes. Battle rap specifically. You battle rappers, so you battle rap bloggers, you league owners. Oh, yeah, they on y'all. They on y'all. They just took surf down from those two things. They took surf down from Instagram and Spaces. And all he do is do that in the battle rap community. Everybody that was in tied in with him, conversation with him, inboxing him, texting him, tweeting him, all y'all is somehow came across the feds now. Yep, under his seven-year investigation. Seven-year investigation. Imagine what he told y'all in seven years, what y'all conversated about, that he was being monitored and recorded on. You battle rappers, you league owners, you bloggers. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. That's a fact. And so much so, he knew it too. He changed his accounts. Before Surf left, he changed his accounts. He made burner accounts. That's also written in the documentations. So not only were they on his original accounts, he thought they could escape him by opening up burner accounts, and they was on the burner accounts too. They was on the burner accounts too. It was the burner accounts that led to his arrest. They, they, they tracked his spaces. They tracked his burner account Seen him on faces, heard him on faces, got the warrant, came surrounded the house. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Y'all better wake up. Y'all better stop playing games. They here. Oh, yeah, they here. Y'all better start flying right. They here. When y'all in them battles and y'all big upping it and all that and saying that like y'all do, that stuff over. What, you know what? It ain't even over. Cause Cat's still gonna be Cat's still playing game. They ain't taking this serious. They ain't taking this serious at all. They think it's a joke. They think they think it's a joke because they not seeing it. Oh yeah, this ain't about entertainment no more. Everything you say will be used against you in the court of law. This ain't about entertainment no more. Oh, uh, see how y'all be in the battle with your rags on and rags all in your pocket, flying. Mm, oh, 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 yeah, that's Rico. And they purposely doing that to black people. Let me tell you something. This is modern day slavery, y'all. This is modern day slavery done the legal way. Okay? Okay? 
This is modern day slavery done the legal way because y'all being racially profiled. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all being profiled. Mm-hmm. Mm -mm. This is so good. This juice is fire. <clears throat> Woo! This juice is fire. Man. Mm -mm -mm. This juice is fire. So good, I can't even drink it out of a cup of glass. I need to get straight to it. Oh, man. How you... God is so good, man. How he made and created all this stuff. and Man, thank you, Lord. Anyway, yeah, they here. Yeah. Y'all all tied into each other in some type of way. I don't look at that as a bad thing. I'm going to keep it 100 with y'all. I don't look at that as a bad thing. Whatever it takes for brothers to, 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 to get their mind right, to make you a better man, to make you a better father, to make you a better husband, to make you a better friend, to make you productive in your community and society. If this is what it takes to get you on a straight path, then so be it. It is what it is. Ain't nothing wrong with change. Ain't nothing wrong with change when you changing for the better. And a lot of you brothers really, really, really need to actually get it together, man. Learn from surf. Learn from what's taking place. Learn from what's going on. Y'all better pay attention to what's happening. Y'all better pay attention to what's happening. Because it's going down. And I'm telling you what I know. I'm not telling you what I think. I'm telling you what I know. You brothers uh, 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 sitting around and everything seemed like it's a joke. Y'all laugh about everything. Y'all so arrogant and prideful. Can't nobody tell you nothing. Y'all got that I don't give a F attitude. Y'all got whatever happened, just happened. I ain't gonna live this. So what? Okay. Y'all always say that till you get locked up. You always say that till you in the hospital. You always say that till you lose somebody. Always acting tough. Always acting tough. Person got to force you to do right by your family and children. That's that nigga stuff, man. Why we so arrogant? Why we so prideful? Why we so cocky? Why we so conditioned? Why are we so desensitized as a people? Man, it's saddening. This is terrible, man. This is terrible. And I'm looking at this situation and I'm telling you what I know. And you know what I come to find? That at the end of the day, no matter what, I always have somebody that just don't get it. They just don't get it. Don't even care to get it. Some people just fools. Some people just ignorant. Just don't care. And just trying to see who they can take down with them. Some people just literally want to take other people down with them. You brother, did he? Look, look, brother's still trying to make a living off hustling and selling dope. Man, stop it. Get up out of here. Brother still trying to run the block. Man, get up out of here. Terrible. Your chances of surviving is slim to none. Because you're going to always be involved. Even when you don't want to be involved. You're going to always be involved. Always. Because if it ain't your drama, it's day drama. Day drama is your drama. Your drama is day drama. Y'all always involved. You're going to always be involved. And guess what? That stuff come to your house. Come to your house. Man, I done lived through that stuff, man. I don't never, ever want to put my family through that stuff ever again. I don't ever want to go through that ever again myself. The process of that is terrible. I'm talking about stupid, terrible. 
but they here. Yeah, make you you think just because they arrested and indicted serving them, they gone, they closed their accounts out. They unsubscribed from everybody. You think they did that? Sorry, they didn't. Not at all. They here for a reason. It's on to the next. It on to the next. Started out just an investigation on surf for the most part. Now they got him. But they got some more information. Who that? See, that's the thing about these federal indictments. It's like a, it's connecting the dots. Not only do it start out with who they were watching. The reason why it's an investigation, it's an indictment, which is a paper trail, is because they see who's all connected to the web, who's connected to that web from the greatest to the smallest. And more people continue to be added in. It started with one. Then one connected two. Two connected three. Three connected four. One of my niggas. Get two of my niggas. Two of my niggas. Bring three of my niggas. Three niggas go and get four of my niggas. Then four of my niggas come back with more. One nigga. Get two niggas. Then two niggas. Get three. Three niggas go get four niggas and four come back with more. Connect to the dots. Oh, Solo. That was a bad impersonation. I don't watch him enough to get it. If I watch him enough, I know how to do it, but I don't watch him enough to get it. But I would say this. Yeah, that's a fact, man. They connect the dots. They like, dang. Because you got to keep in mind, their careers are built off cases. They get paid for incarcerations. They get paid for housing people in prison. Prison is a big business, okay? Prison is a big business. Not only do we get government funding by the hundreds of millions, but they got a lot of contracts with companies and other things within itself. So it's a big business, and they need bodies, in and out, in and out, in and out. It's modern day slavery. And you niggas that's doing this stupid stuff. I say niggas because it's different between niggas and black men. Okay? Niggas and black men. It's, a, it's entirely different. See what I'm saying? See, I'm a black man. I believe in the Lord Jesus Christ. I live an honest life. I live an honest life. I work for a living. No illegal stuff going on in my life. Okay? I understand how to be productive in this community. I understand how to be a giver and not a taker. I understand how to give life and not death. To speak against unrighteousness. To stand up for truth and morality. See, I understand these things. You know, and I'm telling you what's real. These people are here. They here. Can't get around that stuff. They here. And these feds, drug enforcement agency that's taking place, they ain't gone nowhere. They working on another case. And you can imagine who they working on. Y'all know, because y'all were the ones who was having conversations with them. Y'all were the ones who was texting them. Y'all were the ones who was inboxing with him. Did he sell you something? Y'all in trouble. You see that? You see that lady in Atlanta indicting everybody? You see, what's her name? Fannie Mae, Ella Mae, Willa Mae? You see they're indicting everybody? They, look, they got a symptom going on in play, okay? There's a symptom going down in play and niggas need to get in order. Niggas need to get in order. That's how they looking at that. Y'all going to get in order or y'all going to get shipped out. And that's what they trying to do. It's called control. But the only thing about it is you choosing to play the game. Y'all choosing to play the game. Because again, too much showing out. Too much pride, too much arrogance, too much showing out. 
Too much showing out. Too much pride. Too much arrogance. Too much showing out. Y'all better wake up. With that being said, it's your boy Battle Truth. It ain't my judgment. That's some question. It's yours, man. They here. Oh, yeah, they here. I wonder who they working on next. Y'all better make sure them books clean. Y'all better make sure y'all got y'all receipts. Y'all better make sure y'all throw them, put them rags up. Y'all better be careful with the stuff you're saying out of your mouth. But they're going to use that again. They're going I watch what I tell y'all. I guarantee y'all. Well, I already know they finna use so search uh social media stuff against them. I already know that. They just, I'm trying to tell you. They here. They here. They indicted that man off spaces and Instagram. Okay? Spaces and Instagram. Man, please. Y'all in trouble. Oh, oh y'all in trouble. Mm-mm. Y'all in trouble. That being said, it's your boy Battle Truth. Ain't my judgment. That's some question. It's yours. <laughs>